Welcome to day 11 of self-care. And today is a fun one. Today is about expressing yourself in ways that just take you away, Calgon. And so for today, many of you have young children. They might have coloring books, or maybe you have gone out and bought yourself a coloring book. I love it. I don't do it enough, to be honest, but I do love it. And with the coloring books, you know, sometimes you want to get crayons or I don't know why, but the colored pencils don't do it for me. I like to really color color. And of course, being a Virgo, I have to stay within the lines. It's got to look right, right? So you want to find time today. I don't care if it's you're sitting at your desk, you're listening, if you're working from home, let's just clarify that. And you're listening to somebody on the phone, you could be coloring, you know, this person is intense and you need to just take yourself away or you're talking to a relative that isn't exactly the kindest one to you or your family. You're just coloring to take your mind off whatever's being said. And so I do love it. And who doesn't need to help their inner child more, right? Spend more time with our inner child and so coloring can be a really, really good way to just allow yourself to forget it. And it is like staying in the moment, right? Because if if you're like me and you care about how you're coloring, you've got to pay attention. Are you just going, are the lines just going in one direction? What's happening? But this is really, really important because it's just like when somebody's doing automatic writing or whatever, your mind is focused on one thing. So as you're coloring, you're thinking about what color out of this, you know, who doesn't like those Crayola, the big ones with all those different colors? You know, what color do I want to make this? And challenge yourself a little. You know, it takes me back to um, that song by Harry Chapin way back when, you know, green, uh, what, no, what was it? Red flowers are red green flowers are green, you know, and then the child goes to school and they, the teachers, he has a wonderful teacher that says, use all the colors of the rainbow. And he's coloring in all different colors. So you could make whatever color you want, even if there's nothing that color, you know, if you're coloring an animal, you could make a green animal, who cares? It's your imagination in you and it gives you permission for some self-expression that you may not have allowed yourself to use for a long time. Um, so whatever it is, it is. And go out and buy, give yourself permission to buy a new coloring book if you don't, or buy one if you don't have one. And um, I know online they have them or Barnes and Noble, and they're not that expensive, but they're really cool. So you might wanna get one if you're an animal lover of all different kinds of animals or flower lover, Go for the flower ones. Whatever it is, give yourself permission. It's like doodling, right? Only the form is there for you. You're just coloring away. Go take time to pick up one that's wonderful, that expresses your personality, and do it today.